Hello, and welcome to another one of my videos. I'm going to make this one a little bit quicker than normal. For two reasons. One, I'm running out of battery power on the goggles already. I haven't charged them since last time. And two, it's another Flux game, and we all know how Flux is played already. So let's open it up and go through the choice cards that I've selected. Now, let's get some... Put that back in, right. So, it's got your usual action cards, rule cards, surprise cards, creeper cards, and uh, goals and uh, keepers. So, um, yeah, <laughs> there's that. Um, the creepers, there are four in this one. You've got the Wicked Witch of the West, Winged Monkeys, Fighting Trees, and the Wicked Witch of the East. Um, a couple choice goals that I decided to flick through. Uh, two ways to kill a witch. This player who the player who has water and the falling house on the table wins. Um, welcome to Munchkin Town. The player with the yellow brick road and the munchkins on the table wins. And uh, which kind of witch are you? You win if you have the good witch of the north on the table along with at least one other wicked witch. So uh, once again, creepers and keepers working to help you get your goals. Now we have some keepers, some choice ones. These are all the ones I think these are all the ones that have uh, do stuff. Uh, I'm not entirely sure I actually picked them all out. And if not, well, you know, they're in the deck. So you've got the woodman, the tin woodman, sorry, tin man. Uh, and this one says, during your turn, if you have this on the table, you can discard the fighting trees if you have them. Um, not sure if that means if you have them in front of you or anywhere on the, on the board. Uh, we'll check that in a minute. Good Witch of the North, if you have this on the table, you can move one of your creepers to another player. The Fallen House, during your turn, if you have this on the table, you can discard it along with the Wicked Witch of the East, only the Wicked Witch of the East, and you have to discard this card with the Creeper card, Wicked Witch of the East, so you will lose that Keeper. And then you have the Water Keeper, uh, you can discard the Wicked Witch of the West, uh, the difference between this one and the Fallen House is that, um, and it's only the Wicked Witch of the West, is that you can keep the water because there appears to be an abundant supply of water, but not an abundant supply of um, Fallen Houses that will stay in one piece once it lands. <laughs> and then, of course, you've got Toto. So those are some keepers. Oh, let's get them back in the deck there. So it came today, I haven't actually shuffled them up yet, in fact I haven't shuffled up a couple of the other ones that I've got, um, but you know, I haven't played them yet. So a uh, quick look at the uh, rules, uh, your typical normal stuff on this side, but what I found on this side is that there are a lot of frequently asked questions on this one, taking up most of the back. This one should explain most of the stuff like the uh, water card and all that. Uh, let's see, one here for example is the water and fallen housekeepers can both be used to discard one of the witches. Can she be anywhere on the table or only in front of you? The answer is the w uh, wicked witches can be anywhere on the table. So uh, so you have the water and fallen house here, someone else has the wicked witch of the east there, wicked witch of the west there. You can discard I think only one during your turn or maybe both, possibly both, but that's if you want the other players to win or lose depending on the goals. Um, I haven't actually gone through these questions to see about that Tin Man uh, and the trees. So I'm going to assume that uh, you can if the trees are anywhere on the table. And if not, or if it says elsewhere in the rules, well then I'm wrong. But, you know, something to do. So I did say I was going to keep this one short because of battery power. Um, this is Osflux. Number, let's see, one, two, three, uh, this is the fourth one I've got of my own collection. Um, so, uh, yeah, it comes in a nice green um, box, and uh, yeah, so there you go. That's Ozflux.